Hello, welcome to Ride Electric Time Mouth. Uh, I'm the manager, Mark. Um, you may have seen me on the e-bike show recently, uh, well, which we've done a few episodes of. Thought it'd be good today to give you a little look around our showroom and all the different bikes that we have available for test. So, first of all, um, we have the Risa Muller Roadster. You may know that we are an experienced centre for Risa Muller. So, we have lots of different Risa Muller test models. You can come in for an experienced ride with no obligation um, and try out a bike if you're interested. So, we have the Risa Muller Roadster um, built for urban commuting. Um, you do have a gravel tyre on there, so you can take it a little off-road as well if, you, if your route has some nice off-road sections. Um, you've got a 625 watt-hour battery, um, so probably giving you sort of 60, 70 miles range if you're careful on the, on the modes that you're riding in. Um, you can see you can get two different styles of frame, so you can get one with a crossbar, or you can get one with a dropped crossbar. Um, and colours available, you've got salvia matte or you've got black or it also comes in white or grey as well so um, you've got quite a lot of choice on the colours. Um, yeah, with this particular model you get the Bosch Performance Line CX motor so you get an 85 Nm of torque and really when you're riding it it's a very smooth, seamless uh, experience and gives you a lot of power, you know, if you need to get up those hills on your commute. So this one is slightly different iteration of the Roadster, so this is a high speed model. So this one goes up to 28 miles an hour. Um, so for all you speed freaks out there, we, we can help you with that as well. This is one of two different high speed uh, versions that we sell in the shop. So obviously we sell the recent more high speed models. And we also uh, are a dealer for Stroma and very soon we'll have the Stroma ST7 brand new in the UK available for testing in the shop coming soon. Um, this particular model, um, like I say, 28 miles an hour, um, still has the Bosch um, performance line motor, but it's the speed edition. Um, this one's really nice, it's a lovely grey colour. You've got the Nyon display, which is a top of line dis display with Bosch. Um, you get full colour maps um, and navigation on there. You've got a nice lock feature for security. Um, and we've kitted it out with some nice Altlieb panniers. We're a, we're a dealer for Altlieb, so you can buy all your Altlieb accessories with us, bags um, and, and luggage. Even a nice little one that sits on the top tube there for your little snaffle bag, you know, if you want some little sweets on the ride. Um, so yeah, this one's nice. It's got like front suspension on it as well. Um, Magura brakes. Um, yeah, come and, come and try it out. So the way we organise the showroom, we've got um, kind of different zones. So we've just had a look at the commuting bikes um, with the Roadster. This is more of our adventure section. So um, we've got a mountain bike, an adventure bike, and a long touring bike, you know, that will give you, enable you to go a lot further and um, explore some territory that you've not been to before. So first up, we've got the Risa Muller Mountain Delight. Um, as you can see, it's just a stunning looking bike. Um, full suspension, 12 speed derailleur, uh, 625 watt hour battery. Um, it's a beautiful mountain bike, really. Um, we've actually got a resident mountain bike expert with us today, um, who is Sean, uh, one of the mechanics from our workshop. So, what do you think, Sean? You're a, you're a big mountain bike enthusiast. So, What's your opinion on this bike? I really like the bike. The bike comes with Fox Performance uh, suspension. It's got 150 millimeters of travel. Uh, the bike's really, 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 really good to ride. Um, it comes obviously with 12 speed, which helps you climb any mountain you really want to. And it's just a really sturdy bike. The wheels are built strong, the frame's built strong. There's, no, there's nothing you really can, can complain about it. So yeah, and I mean, it really this particular model is really set up for a mountain bike with the with the derailleur set up. You can also configure this bike with a roll off gearing, which will give you fourteen speed and probably even a bit more range on the on the gear ratio. So um, yeah, well worth considering if you're in for some serious long range touring. 
So the next few bikes in the adventure section are kind of similar, so we'll talk about them together. Um, both kind of hardtail bikes. You've got the Charger 4 and the Supercharger. So one of the main differences between these bikes is technology. So actually the Charger 4 is a brand new model for 2023 and it's got the Bosch Smart System in it, which allows you to do a lot more in the Bosch Flow app. Um, it allows you to customize your riding styles and things like that. Um, but essentially these bikes are very similar in terms of um, the frame design, um, how they ride, um, they've both got uh, Mviolo hub gearing um, which gives you a ratio of 380% so you've got a good long range of gears to get you up hills um, and get you along the flat at speed as well. Um, the good thing about that is it allows you to have a belt drive on the bike so you've got um, longevity in your drivetrain um, and it's very clean, there's no mess. Um, and they're just a great looking bike, built solid. You ride all day on this bike and it's comfortable. You've got Thud Buster seat post, um, which it gives you suspension. Um, and obviously the front suspension as well. So another main difference between these bikes is obviously the range that you're getting from the batteries. The Supercharger is called Super because it gets you super long way with all the battery power you've got in there. You've got 500 watt hour in the top and a 625 in the bottom, so 1125 you know you're going to get a long way on that up to probably about 140 miles if you're careful with the riding modes um, with the charger 4 because it's got the smart system it's got the top of the line bosch battery in it for this year which is 750 watt hour so it's probably going to get you maybe 100 miles of range so it really is built for like riding all day um, but yeah, that's the difference between them. Obviously, you've got a little bit of difference in weight. Um, the Supercharger is a heavier bike. Um, so yeah, which one would you choose? Come and try them out. So um, here we have the brand new range for 2023, which is the Risa Muller Urban Line or UBN Line. Um, totally different design language from what they've used before from Risa Muller. You'll notice the frames are sleeker, they're lighter. You've got a different drive system in this. So normally you always have a Bosch drive system with Risa Muller, not this one. You've got Fazua. So the reason for that mainly is because it's lighter. You'll notice when you look at this bike, sometimes it hardly even looks like an e-bike. You can't really see where the motor is. It is in the cranks um, and the battery is hidden in the down tube there, there's a nice slim down tube. You've got 430 watt hour battery. Um, you've still got 60 newton meters of torque from that motor. It's still pretty powerful, even though it's small and light. Um, this really is a lovely bike for urban riding. Riding on tarmac, it's got a semi-slick tire on it. Um, and although you compensate a little bit on range because of the smaller battery, it, it's still a powerful bike that will get you up any hill. So what you've got here is the green one is the Urban 5 and the rose gold one is the Urban 7. Uh, they both come with, uh, well you can configure them with different gearing systems so you can either get the 11 speed derailleur for the touring version you can get the belt drive single speed. So this one hasn't actually got any gears. It's just got the three power levels of the assist. You can actually ride it as well with the, with the assist off because it's so light. Um, and finally, you can also get a silent version, which is a Shimano eight speed hub gear. Um, so that's uh, an, a nice option for commuting as well because it's nice and clean. Um, all the batteries, in the down tube but they do come out as well and as you can see it's a, it's a lovely slimline light battery as well. So uh, here we have uh, one of the bikes in our family range. So this is the Risa Muller Paxter 70. So a bit of history about this bike. So we, we had this bike in last season. It was actually recalled by Risa Muller because of the steering tube. It's actually got a unique steering system with a cable operated steerer, which is unusual for most cargo bikes. You have a normal mechanical steering arm. 
but not on this bike. And the, the reason that it's got that is because it just gives you an unbelievable turning circle. The, the, this bike is so agile, even though it's quite a large um, cargo bucket that you can see, it's so easy to maneuver. Um, so what happened was, Rich Miller recalled all these bikes out of the market, but instead of scrapping them, they took them all back, refurbished them all, and then they've made them available again with the upgraded steering system. So fantastic work from Risa Muller, um, just cementing that brilliant sustainable values that they've got. Um, this is actually a brand new one. This is not a uh, refurbished bike. Um, as you can see, you've got uh, a lovely cargo bucket here. The, the design is really nice on it. You can get up to three children in the front, or you can actually configure this for cargo, so you can get a slightly um, taller cargo um, chamber on the front, so you can get more in it, basically. We've also got a little glove compartment at the back, which is nice. Um, obviously, the things you would expect from recent other bikes, so you've got the uh, belt drive, um, with the twist shift, um, powerful, extra powerful braking on this one because obviously you're carrying heavy loads um, and yeah it's just lovely I mean you can also get this bike in a in a full suspension option so you can get suspension on the back if you want a bit more comfort so lastly on our little tour of the showroom here we are we've got two different step through models to show you so first of all in the back here um, you've got this beautiful Rissimo swing. So the styling is just lovely, isn't it? You know, you've got these baskets that you can use for shopping or, you know, carrying your picnic down to the park. You've got this lovely Dutch style frame. Um, but obviously you can see, although it's that in that Dutch style, it's reinforced. So this is a really stable bike. When you're on it, it just feels nice, you know. You've got front suspension to take up any bumps in the road um, and you can configure this bike differently in, with different gearing systems but we recommend the belt drive and the Violo gear it's what a lot of our customers prefer and um, just because it's so intuitive and easy to use um, so yeah you've got the swing and then finally this one which is the biggest selling model from Risa Muller the Nevo um, just a fantastic bike really um, this one is the basic Nevo model, which has got a slightly thinner tyre, so it gets you off at pace. You can also get this as a GX option, so you can get a, a chunkier tyre. You can configure this actually, um, well, you could configure it as a dual battery bike, so you can get an extra battery in the rack. Um, and there's lots of different options with this bike, which is why a lot of people like it. You can get different displays. And get different cockpits where you can bring the handles up towards you, different gearing systems. You can get a roll off on this bike as well. Um, it, this bike can do a lot, and when you ride it, you want to buy it. So come try it. So, thanks a lot for joining us on this little tour of our showroom here in Time Mouth. Um, as you can see, we've got lots of different bikes to offer you, um, and it's all, always free for an experienced ride, there's no obligation. You can come and try one and find out what it's all about. We spend a lot of time with our customers in investing time into finding a bike that's right for them, um, asking them what their lifestyle's like and what they're gonna use the bike for so that we can provide a product that's suitable for them. And that for us is the, the very best formula because it puts a smile on people's faces um, and yeah, they, they get the, the bike that's right for them. So we're here in Time Mouth Metro Station, right here on platform one. You can come and join us for a free experience ride. But also this year, don't forget, we have our partners in Belfast, you move e-bikes in, Bel in Belfast. We've also got uh, experience rides available at Alive Adventures in Port Rush in Northern Ireland. Um, and soon, very soon, uh, we're going to be opening in concert in County Durham, where we're going to have a dedicated ride electric shop there, where you'll be able to try lots of these bikes. Um, and also we are going to be opening hires from Beadnell in Northumberland, which we're very excited about, because it's only 50 miles up the coast. So you'll be able to hire an e-bike in Beadnell 
bring down the time out and then yeah we'll welcome you here with a nice hot cup of coffee so thanks a lot for watching subscribe to our youtube channel follow us on facebook um, and we look forward to seeing you soon